Hey, how's it going and welcome. My name is Doug Doherty. I live in downtown San Diego. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch this video that I made for you. This video is going to give you an understanding of what search engine optimization is, SEO, and why it's important when you have a business and you own a website. All right. So I just want to jump straight into the video. So as you can see, we're on one of my business pages. My company is Amp Local. We're an internet marketing company. We do web design and we're specialists in SEO. All right. So this is going to be uh, an example internet marketing audit on a business called Strickland Bros Carpet Cleaning. Okay, so uh, they're located in, in San Diego. So, 80% actually 82% of the population, when they need a product or service, they're going to use Google. It's the most popular and powerful way to extract information from the internet. All right. So th what they're going to do is they're going to go to Google, they're going to type in their city and their service. Now this can be used for any product or service. Okay, You may have a limousine company, you may do carpet cleaning, you may be a realtor, an attorney, um, you may provide financial services, uh, tree services, um, you, it, it, it's endless. Window tinting, mobile car wash service, any service that you provide, it doesn't matter. Okay, SEO is vital. All right, and the way somebody's going to find you is the product and service in Google. Okay, so to find carpet cleaning, they're going to type in carpet cleaning San Diego. All right, so this is the first page of the search carpet cleaning San Diego. So, as you may already know, this is your map listings. Okay, and this starts your organic listings right here with number one. All right, so for this company, um, I didn't find them until page five. Okay, ranked number 46. All right, number 46, page five. Let me show you this chart real quick. This chart shows you who gets all of all of the clicks for those keyword searches, okay? Um, the number one ranked person gets 34% of the clicks, all right? Number 15, which is on page two, gets maybe not even 1%, okay? So huge, huge difference um, in, in the amount of business you're bringing in from the most popular, powerful uh, internet extractor in the world, all right? I want to give you one more example of what the difference in those in the ranks from being on page five or page two. By the way, if you're on page two, you might as well be on page twenty. All right, ninety-one percent of the clicks come from page one. Um, so Strickland Bros Carpet Cleaning. Let's see how many clicks they get average in a month. Okay, they actually get six clicks in a month for the month of December. Looks like they got eleven clicks on that website. Okay, let me show you what their top competitor did. All right, so this is Carpet Cleaning San Diego, first page of Google. Uh, rank number four right here, same day carpet care. Okay. They got how many clicks? They're averaging 106 clicks a month. Okay. And for December, they got 240, 204. All right. That's 20 times more. Imagine getting 20 times more business. All right. 20 times more clients. That's incredible. All right. That's just a quick example to put it into better perspective. So how do we get you ranked at the top of these Google searches? All right. Well, let me tell you. Google has 200 determining factors in its algorithm. All right. I'm not going to talk about all of them. I only have you here for a few minutes. I'm going to talk to you about the four very most important ones. All right. That are actually a part of my SEO business model. Um, that's going to get you the exposure that your company deserves. All right. The first one is authoritative content. So let's go over the web page. What I mean by authoritative content is there uh, elaborate information relevant to the topic of carpet cleaning on this web page all right is the carpet cleaning mentioned upholstery any other services mentioned on the on the page is it mentioned multiple times is it mentioned in san diego san diego county serving san diego all of these keywords are very very important it has to be mentioned on the home page and when you do authoritative content 1000 to 2000 words is mandatory that's what's recommended all right, so for these guys, they have this one paragraph here. Okay, this is not authoritative content. Let me show you an example of that. Went to Google, typed in elephant. Number one, Wikipedia. I'm going to click on it. Wikipedia is notorious for popping up number one. Why? Because look at their page. Authoritative content. Endless amounts of information on elephants, their evolution, what they eat, where they live, their habitat. All this great stuff, okay? Now, this is extreme. This is probably 30,000 plus words. Again, I recommend 1,000 to 2,000 on the home page. That's very, very important. Next, being mobile friendly. 60% of people today, um, they're actually going to use their iPhone, Android, or smart device, mobile device to, to look for that product or service. So you have to look great right on a mobile device. And most importantly, Google takes it very seriously. 
all right, in today's generation, you have to look great on device. It's a standard. All right, so for these guys, they're not mobile friendly for various reasons. Text is too small, too close, links too close together. Okay, this is very, very important, okay, to understand. Next, business listings. We also call these citations, okay? Some examples Yahoo, Facebook, Bing, Yellow Pages, White Pages, okay? When we do these, these are very, very important. This is how we get our name and our product out on the market. All right. Uh, we have to have our business name, address, and phone number identical on all the platforms because if not, Google's going to slap us down. So for these guys, there's variations in the business name. Okay, right here, two, uh, right here again. And most, imp most importantly, that's causing this 53% error rate is they're missing listings. They don't have a Facebook. They're not in the white pages. They're not in Foursquare. Okay, so Google's taking this very seriously. Not only that there's clients that can't find them that's looking for carpet cleaning uh, in those um, listings, Google's not taking them serious because they're not listed, and, and they're not listed accurately with their accurate information. Okay, this is the top 50 in the country. You definitely want to be listed in all of these, but there are thousands of them. Um, to be competitive, you want to be in three, four, even 500. All right, so that's business listings. Next, the fourth and final one, um, backlinks. We also call these uh, influence pages. So say you have a client thoroughly impressed with your service or product, okay, which I'm sure happens all the time. Um, say they write articles, they have a website, they do blogs. What they'll do is actually write an article and link uh, your website to their website. So anyone reading that article can click the link and go directly to your website. Now this is awesome because now you have a new prospect, but most importantly, uh, Google takes that as a vote, okay? Google is a popularity contest, all right? It's just like running for president. The more votes you have, the more likely you're going to win the position, okay? And that's exactly how you have to think about Google, all right? So some numbers on this page I want you to, to focus on, all right? The first one is referring domains, okay? They have eight. The next one is trust flow, which is at zero, okay? Let me show you this chart. This chart shows you the quality of those domains. The trust flow is, is the quality, okay? So for them, the zero, which is the quality of the domains of eight, there's eight, eight domains, but all of them are the quality of zero, which it's low quality websites. So this is not, this, they're in obscurity, they're of non-importance, okay? So what I do, is I actually get high quality domains, publish legitimate professional articles about your product or service and link your website so Google can see that you have the votes. And what all my uh, domains are, are 20, 25 plus. So up here, all right, surpassing all of your competitors. So over time, you're gonna wanna have hundreds of these. This number is gonna be in the hundreds. These backlinks, just a side note of 12, is a direct reflection of how many times uh, your website is mentioned within these eight domains. Okay, so that's what's going on. All right, so that's the numbers I want you to focus on. These, this is very, very important. Um, the influence pages are directly responsible for the organic rankings. Okay, organic rankings, influence pages. This is what's most responsible for citations. The, remember the fifty-three percent error rate. This is directly responsible for the map listings, okay? This is very important though. These two pieces go very hand in hand and dominate in the space, all right? So um, the reason why I am so successful and I'm great at what I do is because I find out what your competitors are doing online and uh, I do more and I dominate the space. I figure out the keywords that are necessary to, to expand your company online for whatever you're serving I use those keywords, um, I do the citations, I get the high quality domains, I figure out what your competitors are doing, and I do more, okay? And if you're not mobile friendly, I get you mobile friendly, okay? So this is very important knowledge if you're serious about growing your business, um, getting more clients, getting more revenue, um, definitely something you need to consider. Uh, SEO truly is like wheels and fuel for your car, okay, but for your website. so. Again, I thank you for your time that you took to watch this video. Um, in the email, you have my name, my number, and my email address. If any of this makes sense for you and your company, uh, I would really love to have a conversation with you about it. Okay. So again, thanks for your time, um, and I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great day.